Hello, traders. It's E from MarketWizards.com and eMiniWizard.com. And just after noon on Friday, the 16th of August, 2019, reminding traders to use risk capital you can afford to lose. Looking for traders who are hungry for a home that you will learn ideas that will work day in and day out, starting with some base concepts and then obviously uh, applying them in a more advanced level to those traders who are capable of handling that. And realistically, don't care whether they are traders who are trading the micros or the big boys or the e-mini S&P. Uh, we've got something for everybody, whether you're a day trader, a swing trader, or uh, obviously a position trader. Quick look at today's chart. We had yesterday called at 25 support, 22 to 25. Today we called the support 65s. Make sure you are paid 65s to 64 if we got there. And the goal was to see if we could get a retest failure to buy the opens and try to get a retest failure or higher. We like to squeeze trade today. We thought we were lucky to get back to 65. Our target was 82.50 to 81 and a quarter pre-market. So we use that as our resistance for the short scalp trade. Said we'll be lucky to get back there and try to get on board with a ride and see if we can take that out. Ultimately, the next targets became the 86.75 and then a 93 target we had. And we advise traders to make sure you are paid by 91s for sure. And anything above that was gravy. This is one of the charts that we use and rely on, our predictive chart. We thought the flip today was from 52s, 51 and a half, according to the system, and targets step by step. Try to get to that 71, 72 target. Then obviously the 81s, probably everybody looking at that 81. And we thought the risk was all the way back here. We thought that that could be achieved. That was a stretch. <clears throat> but as the market started to squeeze, we thought that was a doable target. Our best friend this morning was the one minute chart. We had an eye on this sideways. We were saying, oh my goodness, are we going to get all day just sideways? We were hoping to, to bust the highs and at least get to that 82s. And sure enough, we got some kind of a news to kick in towards the end of IB. And then it was just make, even if you weren't on board, climb on board and use the squeeze to try to get to that 91 target, 91, 93. We said by 92s, take it and run. Not looking for a plunge. We were just simply looking to make sure we got paid and then out the door and start your weekend early. On the retest failure, we suggested using if you had profits you were willing to risk and use that 93 as your stop for the short. And I had a magnet back in here at uh, 83.75 and I suggested paid for sure by 83.75 on a, on a pullback. And uh, that's the type of trading we like to do in and out and see if you can add to what you've got in your pocket. Hopefully these ideas are things that will help you with your trading. If you're looking for a home to hang out with some professional traders, give us a look. Have a wonderful weekend, everybody. E from marketwizards.com and eminiwizard.com. Suggesting you use risk capital you can afford to lose when you play this game. And uh, be well. Thanks for listening.